hey guys welcome back to my channel so I video recorded my experience eating ramen at nighttime on my camera and I found out that I can edit while I'm on vacation so I thought to myself why not I'm gonna make another video describing why I chose this specific hotel here so without further ado let's get this video started all right guys so the number one reason why I chose Appa Hotel is because of its convenience. It is literally located 150 meters away from the station. I swear to God, you cannot miss this hotel. As soon as you walk out of the exit, you will reach this hotel in no time. The second reason why I chose this hotel is because if you look right on top, is Family Mart. And it's literally right there. So that's my hotel and that's Family Mart. How awesome is that? <laughs> the third reason why I chose Appa Hotel is because it is centrally located to most of the attraction, okay? So the biggest attraction here in Asakusa is Senjoji Temple, which is located 10 minutes away from this specific hotel. Let's go inside and I'll give you another reason why I chose this hotel. Okay, so the fourth reason why I chose this specific hotel is because Apple Hotel is one of the largest hotel chains in Tokyo. And you can literally walk a few distance away to most of the attraction and you'll see an Apple chain hotel. I swear to God, it's pretty much everywhere. So this is the lobby of the hotel. It's clean. Uh, it has a very distinct hotel smell. It's very refreshing. Now on my right hand side is the washroom. In this specific room, there is also an ice machine and a microwave. Let's go and have a quick look for you guys. So you just have to press this. Here is the ice machine, here is their vending machine, and their microwave. And along this side is two washroom and a family washroom. On the left hand side as you walk in is their restaurant. This is where we'll be having breakfast and I will give you a review on that as well. isn't much there isn't a gym or a pool or a spa area or anything like that but for the price you can't beat this okay so now let's go to our room and give you a quick room tour our room is located right around the corner as soon as you get out of the elevator on the fourth floor room 409 give you a quick uh, review of our room it's basically simple nothing to wow about so as you walk right inside on the left hand side over here is the washroom we're getting ready to pack so that's why it's a little messy basically as you walk in this is a bed over here it's a double bed uh, I can sleep comfortably uh, nothing special and if you turn just around a corner over here they have a big TV screen for you and let's show you what it is like as you walk in so this is the hallway it's extremely small not much space they got um, places where you can hang your clothes a mirror on this side desk that's pretty much it now they do have some amenities they got a refrigerator down here you can see right there and they got some coffee and tea I'm gonna open the box for them some coffee and tea we had our coffee this morning and a kettle you can see that kettle right over there 
and then let's go to the washroom I swear to god as soon as you walk into the washroom you're like is this really the washroom it's super small so right here is their shower and tub as you can see uh, they do have some amenities for you toothbrush a razor a comb we haven't used any one of them and this toilet is amazing Japanese style it it's basically a bidet it's electric and it's a seat warmer and to use it is you just operate over on the right hand side and you press a button basically so yeah that's the room review for you guys all right let's check out the breakfast right over here okay there's coffee there. yeah there's coffee there all right let's sit down here is their menu you guys can have a quick look and do your own translation For this one guys this is the soba soba udang set let's see what you ordered that's a nice set what do you have here you, you don't know that's definitely miso that's rice for sure is that odin hmm. okay you got tofu egg and fish and then these are some side dishes, very similar to what Koreans do with their uh, meal. Yeah, that's their overall meal. And this is seaweed, right? Seaweed. Nice. So we're gonna give you a quick uh, review of this. She's just, she's just gonna eat some, some dishes for you. It's quite a lot, so we can review everything. Okay, try the soy for me. This is actually quite interesting. Thank you very much. So my dish has arrived as well. This is tuna. And uh, this is uh, some sort of noodle dish. Looks absolutely amazing, man. I'm gonna review this entire set for you. Okay, tell me how the miso soup tastes like. Is it good? Okay. This is fermented bean. It looks so amazing. Look how colorful their set is. I swear to God, you guys, you guys gotta come to Japan and try it for yourself. Is it good? Very unique. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay, my turn. Everything's getting a little warm here, so I gotta start eating the at least the soba. The soba noodle for you guys. It's Odin. Is it Odin? You see this? I don't know if you can see that. That's just like fresh. We got the dashi broth. This is a dashi broth right here. It's nice and clear. Mm. So, one thing I recommend when you book a hotel. Is also add breakfast to your hotel stay. It just makes the experience ten times better. You know, you don't have to worry. Okay, what am I gonna eat in the morning? You just come downstairs and have yourself a nice meal. Literally. So one thing I want to say about this soba noodle is it's light and very refreshing. It's a healthy start to your day. You know what I mean? And you also have this fish cake. Mmm, it's like packed with umami flavor. It's so unreal. <music> Lastly, one of the things that I really like about the set menu is they give you the right amount of portion. Not to overfill you, 
or to underfill you. They give you enough so you feel satisfied to start your vacation experience, right? Okay, time for their second meal. That's on this set. It's this bowl of tuna and rice mixed with a vegetable. So crazy. So I mix it up already and it's time to begin. Wow, it is like so fresh, so fresh. That's all I'm gonna say. It's like the quality of the food, bar none. And there's tuna. I think there's adamame and there's seaweed and there's an egg. And just look at how glistening it is. It's like perfectly cooked. All right, guys. I'm gonna pretty much end this video because it's gonna get way too long. If you like this video please click like and subscribe and i'll definitely see you guys in the next video have a good day cheers okay guys so i just had an amazing set of japanese food absolutely crazy i'm just having coffee right now and uh, i'm gonna give you my rating i'd say 9.5 out of 10. excellent uh, if you happen to be in japan check out one of the apa chain hotel and uh, order their breakfast. It's absolutely amazing. Cheers, guys.